Hey everybody, how you doing? This is about to be a really fun video. I am on the way to my buddy Paul's place. Y'all watching the videos, you know Paul. If, if you don't know Paul, he's my good buddy. He's got a channel called Heavy Metal. Y'all make sure you're subscribed to Heavy Metal too. But I just had a new Bing Bang delivered and it's one that I've been looking forward to getting for a long, long time. And it is in my absolute favorite Bing Bang, which, y'all that watch the channel, what's my favorite? My absolute favorite is my CVA Cascade in 22250. So, oh man, I can't tell you until I pick it up. But I got a new CVA Cascade. I won't tell you the chambering until we pick it up, but I'm running over to Paul's place we're gonna pick it up and I'm super crazy excited to show you I've been so excited about picking one of these up I've already got a bunch of boo lots for it I've already got a scope sitting on the shelf ready to go for it and yeah I don't think I can be any more excited to pick something up that being said I will see you at the shop and we're gonna pick this thing up I'm gonna get it all ready to go and it's gonna be in a bunch of videos stay tuned I'll be back at you real quick. Here we go, heavy metal. Like I said, he's got the Bing Bang channel and he's got the customs channel where he's building all kind of hot rods and whatnot. Kind of like that thing right there, pretty cool. But I'll have those links down below. Make sure you're subscribed to his channel, but let's uh, see if we can find this Boo Light Slinger. There's a box. And there's Paul. Everybody say hey to Paul. Hey, Paul. <laughs> I already told them to go subscribe to your channels. Yeah. And CVA Cascade. Y'all know I'm a huge fan of them. And this is the brand new XT model there. 6.5 PRC. Super, super sweet. Brake on it. Fluted barrel. So I get it all put together and put a scope on it. I'll show you up a lot closer. All right. So now I'm back at the house. I'm getting this thing all set it up. I got in the vice. 6.5 PRC is some serious horsepower. You got some serious horsepower. You want to reach out and touch something. You need some serious scopies with some turrets where we can do some clicking. Where we can stretch it out in some videos we're going to be doing. So look at the scope I got for this thing. Flip the camera around. This right here, if y'all watch the channel, you've seen me mess with Black Hound before, but this is what I got for it. A Black Hound Evolve 5 to 25 by 56 with mills. You can see it's got the Christmas tree reticle, good for some long range stuff. And you can see all the specs right there. Got a 34 millimeter tube. That's the first 34 millimeter tube I have ever gotten. And like I said, it's in mills. It's got the zero stop and all that fancy stuff. But <clears throat> if you've never messed with Black Hound, I'll put a link down below somewhere where you can find this one. But cool thing about Black Hound that not a lot of other people do, check it out. Every one comes with levels and the rings. So you don't have to sit there and worry about what rings do I need or wait for your rings to show up. You pick up the black hounds, come with the levels, the rings. This one's got a sunshade on it, too. Might slap that on there, make it look Daddy, even bigger. Jackson. Jackson, I think he's upstairs, baby. Oh. Yeah. And then, like I said, this one's got exposed tar uh, turrets. All right. Okay, baby. And then it comes with this quality control checklist, even. Tells you who inspected it and all that and when they inspected it. So they inspected this baby, shoot, a couple weeks ago. But that's what I'm slapping on this 6.5 PRC. We're going to get it on there and I'll show you the whole rig set up here in a second. All right, now I got it set up, but everyone asked me, so I'm going to show you. I use these Wheeler Fat Sticks torque wrenches on just about everything now. And I've got this worn torque wrench just has this one it's got a beeper and I use that on anything that has these nuts right here so 
I use the 45 inch pounds for my 20 MOA rail here that worn this thing for those. And then I swap this up for the 25 inch pounds for the rings right here. All right, guys. Now that I got this thing put together, it's putting an even bigger smile on my face. But this is, like I said, CVA's new centerfire. This is the Cascade XT, which stands for extreme. What's new about it? Got a new camo pattern. This is the real tree hillside camo pattern. Check that out there. Pretty, pretty cool. If you give me an option, I will always pick camo over a black. Some people prefer other stuff, but hey, I like the camo stuff, especially in a hunting rig. And we are definitely going to be doing some hunting with this 6.5 PRC. What else is different? It has a bigger bolt knob there. It has a number five tapered fluted barrel. So it's a little bit heavier barrel, number five taper fluted. And it comes factory with this muzzle brake. So it comes with a brake. That's pretty awesome. Or it's threaded so we can put the shisher cans on them. You know I'm going to be filming a video suppressed 6.5 PRC. But how I have this set up, I'm going to be doing some long range stuff with it. So I went ahead and I got a 20 MOA rail. If you're not familiar with the, what that means, essentially, it makes this a little bit higher and this a little bit lower. So off the bat, you're starting off with your scope tilted down, which allows you to have more elevation dial for when you're trying to do some long range stuff. So 20 MOA rail on mine. We're definitely going to be having this in a bunch of videos, testing it out, all different type of blue light tests in it. Going to do some steel long range stuff. Going to try to do some white tail chasing with this thing. And uh, we're going to see how far we can stretch it out with this black hound optic we put on here. It's even kind of a cool little touch. They put Evolve right there. I've got the, the sunshade on there, so the scope isn't actually that long. That's the sunshade. Yeah. I think next time I'm in town, I might grab some spray paint that's some tan and some green and color up this scope. I think that'd look even cooler. But hey, brand new from CVA. You guys that watch the show know I am a huge CVA fan, both in the muzzle loaders and in the center fires. My CVA Cascade in 22-250 is literally my favorite Boulot Slinger. But hey, stay tuned for a lot more on this CVA Cascade XT. This thing is absolutely awesome. Real quick before we go, almost forgot to tell you, something else that's really cool, this action is super smooth. So we might have to do some testing out there at the range where we try to do some quick follow-up shots and stuff like that. Uh, but yeah. Really smooth action on this thing. CVA Cascade XT. This one is in 6.5 PRC. They've got it in several other cartridges already. Appreciate y'all watching. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Super excited to get this baby out to the range. I've already been picking up the boo lots for it. So we got quite a bit to test already. But hey, appreciate y'all watching. We'll see you on the next one. Hoo-dee-hoo.